Hi, everybody. Look at it. We're just getting right into it. There's the fuselage crate. FedEx called me on Monday. Hey, we got your crate. When do you want it delivered? I'm like, how about today? The day you said you would. They said we could not. So, had to wait till Wednesday. So, this is Wednesday. Two days ago. Couldn't help myself. I wanted to get it out. So, I mean, I, may, I, mean, I wanted to get a video out. I've been waiting so long. So happy. <clears throat> so, there's a little bit of crate damage. Uh, I mean, a very small amount. That's the hammer you you need. So whenever, you know, these, these lids are put on pretty tight, you need them. Good hammer, some nice mass to it. So there's only, a couple, like I said, a couple pieces of uh, damage on the crate. Picture here. Picture here. Uh, luckily, upon first inspection, um, doesn't seem to actually be any parts damage, which is good. So, yeah, so, uh, okay, there there I am overlooking the 11-page inventory list. The wings were eight, just to give you a little bit of scale. Again. So this is my third kit, again, vans. Great on the shipping. Look at all those parts. God, that's gorgeous. There is the giant bag of death. Here's a better picture of that bag of death. <clears throat> that's the bag we all love. That's fasteners. That's all kinds of stuff. <clears throat> Pardon me. So, yeah, I mean... I'm excited, finally, getting into it. That's a lot of pages on that list. So now I've got to count all that stuff, and I really only have five days to do it. So if I need to claim anything against the shipping company, I've got to do that in five days. So on to counting. I mean, I was doing it that night. My, uh, <clears throat> my wife has taken a trip out to New York. Uh this whole next week, uh, which which is fine. She'll be gone Sunday morning. That's good. So basically, I'm going to have to do this all on Sunday. I haven't had a chance to go back out. So this is Wednesday night. Uh, <clears throat> work. Work tonight. <clears throat> I'm done, but I'm beat. So I might get a, a couple hours in tomorrow and Saturday, but I got I basically have to do all of this on Sunday. Although, no, wait. We got Monday off. It's President's Day. Sweet. Sweet. So there's the first kit going through the inventory. You can see all those parts were delicately organized into that battery box. Someone had fun Tetrising that. That's, you know, I'd love that shit. So I, <clears throat> at the time, I didn't realize how dark it was when I started doing this. I'm, I was looking at, so basically I pick up a piece, look at the serial number, look at the list, mark it off, and move on. And I'm, and I'm trying to just kind of hold the pieces with my hand to kind of show what they are, but it was so dark, the shadows are covering up the pieces. Don't worry, you're going to get to see all of this. Here's just a, this is just a group of long pieces of metal. <laughs> and there are several one of those. But, hey, why bother counting when I can play a game of Tetris instead? So, yep, yeah, just counting away. I mean, you know, wait, look, I'm excited. It's a lot of parts. Um, so I'll be back at it this weekend. I just, I wanted to share this. Because I've been talking about getting this damn fuselage for the last two to three months. Feels like. Uh, one other update. <clears throat> I've got uh, my AME appointment uh, Monday. And there's a little bit of a change in my life. Here's a picture. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Yep. Pretty much says it all. Unfortunately, I'm going to probably need those glasses to fly. And I hate them. 
Granted, this is the first time I'm wearing them, but I, I hate them. I hate that I put them on and everything is crystal clear. Anyway, <clears throat> thanks for riding along with me, and, and uh, we'll be unpacking more in the future, so see you soon.